All right, everyone. This is Talking with Todd. I'm back at it with a discussion on depression. Now, the first thing I want to do is to make everybody feel comfortable. So I'm going to put myself out there a little bit. Um, in my life, I've had a lot of feelings of depression. I've been through it. And, um, <clears throat> you know, it may continue on certain aspects of my life in the future um, but I'm prepared for it. I know what I need to do when you know I start letting that funk in my life you know um, I will tell you one of the first times when depression really got a hold of me um, you know as about 20 years ago um, after my first transplant when I was 10 years old, um, I realized that cystinosis, this disease that I was born with, was a pretty serious thing. Um, and I did not like it. But the, the way I overcame it was to be more open and honest about myself and what I was going through. I reached out to others even though I, I was scared. Um, I was scared of judgment and things like that. Um, I didn't want to be judged. I didn't want to be looked at as weird or, oh, you know, the, the, the status of depression in society today is it can be overwhelming. People can look down on you. Uh, people think you're weird or things like that. But let me tell you right now, depression affects everybody. Uh, it's just that we all don't like to be judged that's just human nature and that's how it is but to overcome something you have faced your whole life with that is an extreme step forward and we all will deal with many issues in our life whether it is loss of a loved one, death of a pet, um, personal relationships that did not work out or not going as you planned. Listen, if you find yourself in a toxic situation, you need to start looking at the great things we have in life. Um, even the simple things as, you know, an early morning sunrise or the pleasure you you get out of of going to your favorite restaurant or or especially um putting yourselves in situations where you feel vulnerable do that because when you can come out and speak up people are going to listen and people are going to want to help you people are going to want to be there for you and they have nothing but love and concern for you that is a true friend that is a person you want in your life find the things and the people you want in your life it is so important to be happy within you find where you can be content listen I know life is not easy it's not easy for people with cystinosis but it's not easy for anyone life is precious and having people in your life is key.